हेलो फ्रेंड एंड वेलकम टू केम एफिनिटी इस वीडियो में हम रिव्यू करेंगे एन आई के बारे में तो वहाँ पर क्या है एप्लाइड केमिस्ट्री है तो वहाँ पर एप्लाइड केमिस्ट्री होता क्या है केमिस्ट्री का कौन कौन सा सब्जेक्ट पढ़ाया जाता है एंड uh, उसका जो फ्यूचर है वो कैसा है वहाँ पर प्लेसमेंट होता है कि नहीं होता है उसका फैस, uh, मतलब फैकल्टी कैसे है तो ये सब हम डिटेल्स में डिस्कस करेंगे मगर आगे बढ़ने से पहले अगर तुम ये चैनल पर नया हो तो चैनल को जरूर सब्सक्राइब कर देना देखो हम तुमको जो ग्राउंड रियलिटी है हर इंस्टीट्यूट का उसके साथ तुम तुमको मतलब ठीक है वो लिंक आ, हम लोग करना चाहते हैं ठीक है इसलिए ये सीरीज लेके आए क्योंकि तुमको भी हेल्प होगा इससे कि एक इंस्टीट्यूट के बारे में आ, क्लियर आइडिया हो जाएगा वहाँ पर जाने के पहले ठीक है और यहाँ मतलब इससे तुम क्लियर भी हो सकते हो कि वहाँ पर जाना सही होगा कि नहीं होगा तो इसलिए आ, हम लोग को सपोर्ट करें इसके बाद आएगा त्रिची वारंगल राउरकेला जामशेदपुर जालंधर ये सब आएगा लेकिन अगर तुम चैनल को सपोर्ट और सब्सक्राइब नहीं कर पा रहे हो तो आई एम सॉरी फॉर दैट कि ये सीरीज आगे नहीं बढ़ पाएगा ठीक है तो अगर तुमको ज़रूरत है और तुम्हारे फ्रेंड को भी ज़रूरत है तो प्लीज़ चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कर देना और हमारे साथ जुड़े रहना है सपोर्ट करना ठीक है फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू सो मच सोमोदी दे एंड प्रेरणा रॉय फॉर बीइंग बाय योर साइड हाय आई एम प्रेरणा रॉय अ पोस्ट ग्रेजुएट स्टूडेंट स्टडीड स्टडीड एमएससी इन अप्लाइड केमिस्ट्री फ्रॉम नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ टेक्नोलॉजी सिलचर वेल अप्लाइड केमिस्ट्री इज बेसिकली अ सब्जेक्ट व्हिच इंक्लूड्स द वेरियस एप्लीकेशन ऑफ द केमिकल थ्योरीज व्हिच वी हैव लर्नड इन रियल लाइफ और इन द इंडस्ट्री दिस इंक्लूड्स पॉलीमर साइंस Uh, also includes green chemistry and it will include chemical engineering too so in the first sem semester we get to learn about pure chemistry mostly building up the base from the second semester uh, we start with uh, uh, environmental uh, chemistry and engineering then comes the uh, physical methods of analytical chemistry and also in organic we study synthetic methods in organic chemistry and in the third semester we have uh, chemical engineering principles polymer chemistry uh and also green chemistry and technology and for the final semester we have a compulsory subject which is applied organometallics along with uh, an elective subject we can choose among various elective subjects which includes includes uh, energy and environment catalyst and surface science uh, medicinal chemistry drug designing uh, fuel technology and petroleum science too so we can choose among these uh, subjects as our elective for the fourth semester and along with this we have to do a project under uh, the different topics that uh, under any topic that we can choose among the different topics available basically our project is based on material synthesis and uh, it's like we generally synthesize new materials novel materials uh, to uh, bring up a different uh, uh, arena of research here for the msc students so yeah uh faculties here are very very supportive uh, they are mostly uh, they are uh, they are pretty informal and since we live uh, like it's a residential college so uh, we not only get them in the department we also have them outside the department for interaction so definitely they are very helpful and uh, way more interactive than i think it can be found in normal universities so definitely that's a plus point here the weather in silchar uh, silchar is one of the places one of the rainiest places around i think so you can actually face uh, like three kinds of weather in one day like in the morning it's going to be sunny in the evening it's going to be rainy and at night it's going to be a little bit of cold so you would need a bed cover so yeah um, that is the kind of weather that we get in silchar and so it's a fine weather it is act actually uh, pretty amazing Uh, definitely hostels are offered for accommodation of students because it's a residential college and separate hostels for uh, married pg scholars are available separate girls hostels and boys hostels are also available uh, any special facility uh, definitely uh, uh, we get the asia's biggest digital library here and here also uh, digital books and uh, journal subscriptions are available along with normal paperback books and uh, a, a huge variety of books are available for uh, different departments and so being uh, students of department of chemistry we can also uh, look for different books from mechanical engineering civil engineering whatever we want everything is allowed so that is definitely a facility we get here uh, disadvantage uh, not 
much but one thing is there that is the syllabus that is there in our applied chemistry is quite different from the net syllabus CSIR net syllabus but it is pretty similar to the gate syllabus. So, you will get common uh, commons with the gate syllabus but very less common things uh, with the net syllabus. So, preparation of net uh, has to uh, you know you have to give a different a try and different time for it. Um, okay, so and definitely since uh, there is pressure for the semester exams, but not so much that preparation for the competitives will be hampered. So, you will get ample time to prepare and I think it gives you one of the best free opportunities to prepare for this kind of uh, competitive exams because library is also there and pressure of the syllabus is less. So, definitely you can prepare with all your heart and all the uh, as much as passion as you can for your competitive exams. Uh, coming to the uh, uh, coming to the placement, well placements are actually good uh, as we can see the records of NIT Silcher 82 percent have been placed and uh, from uh, this year and also we have seen uh, from the previous is also. So, it is not that, that since you are in chemistry you are only going to get jobs in chemical companies, you can also get in various IT cloud companies and different uh, types of companies obviously you have to face the interview. But various opportunities are given and placement is actually good, uh, it is not only just educational companies. Uh, there are various more other companies you can get into the industry from uh, like direct campus placements. So, placements are quite amazing here. And lastly, uh, coming to research perspective. Well, uh, research perspective is very good in this uh, institute because from the beginning of the I think third semester we have started writing review papers and they are actually being published right now. Uh, review, uh, review papers and book chapters are written by many uh, by many of the even MSc students and definitely our MSc project is there which opens up various arenas of research in front of us we just being MSc students. We do uh, in our project we do fresh work on material synthesis and then various its various applications. So, definitely it is like a mini PhD program. We, uh, we get to learn new things from various PhD scholars and definitely understand the uh, research life way better. And we also tend to publish some papers in our MSc career itself. So, definitely there is a lot of research perspective and um, the, a student can definitely decide uh, for a future, uh, future career in research as well as in industry from NIT Silchar, that is all.